Oh, okay. So come back in. All right. Oh, I should have popped this. There we go. Before I load it. All right. So we'll do a little Forbidden West, I think. I just, I didn't want to be done streaming, but I was kind of done. I really like Frostmonk, so I don't want to say, like, I was kind of done to make it sound like I was bored. I, I, I was really enjoying it. Um, I just was ready for other things. Um, let's see, so where are we at? I, um, I did play a little bit off stream since we last checked in. I fulfilled this lady's contracts. Hey, John, welcome in to stream part two. Um, so we had found her. She was the second person that was like, oh, do you want to do the thing or whatever? So, um, it, for what's eventually going to become a build the best armor. So I, I did that. Um, I went back to Gaia a few times to get some stuff unlocked. Um, like I just did small exploration things. I've gotten a few more skills. Um, I've bought some weapons, like We've just done a few, a few odds and ends. Hold on. I'm also dealing with a work thing, so I kind of need to respond to this. Sorry about that. There's a one of the quirky things when you work with people at different times is you sometimes have to talk about work when you're not at work because that's when the other person's at work. Um, but in this case, I also like the person I was talking to, so it's fine. So I'm really fascinated by this this unknown tremor tremor tusk site. This is just on the mountain. I wonder if that's going to become a story thing or not. Um, this is just me trying to gather stuff because I've uh, uh, been trying to upgrade things. And I, I figured out, finally, this jobs isn't actually like a, a thing you get or get assigned. It's I can go into upgrades and say, create a job for this upgrade. And it goes here. So these are actually like self-made quests, which is helpful um, so anyway uh, where we're at or where I am at here literally is hunter grounds I went and unlocked a new set of hunting grounds um, which maybe we'll do maybe we won't it was actually nice that this is the first time I finally got to fight fellow backs because um, I couldn't actually like do anything with them because uh I hadn't unlocked them uh, but that's fine sorry I'm a little bit not on my best uh, today not for any particular reason like Sometimes I'm not at my best because stuff happened. Legitimately, it's not because anything happened this time. I'm just, just a little off. All right, let's do this. We'll head to this rebel camp. I think that'll be a good way to get me into a shooting game again um, outside of a, a city builder. So we'll do this. Uh, we'll do this rebel camp, and then we'll work our way down to uh, the Memorial Grove. I think that'll be a good way to go about things. No. These are actually pretty hard hunting grounds, I'm gonna be gonna be completely honest. I figured out that um there was a bunch of upgrades I didn't get because of fish, so I, I had to do a little bit of looking. Um a lot of the upgrades I needed needed salmon, and I had assumed salmon were going to be somewhere else, and they weren't. So basically, like, 
I spent a long time fishing here because this is the only place I knew where there were fish. Then it turns out there's only carp here. <laughs> and so then I looked it up. There's nothing in here, which is weird. Uh, but then there's salmon like here. There's one random spot. It's like, oh, okay, sure. We could probably go after that Thunderjaw and get that one drone thing too. That might not be the worst thing to do. But I probably am only gonna go, I mean like, whoops. In theory, we've only done half the length of a normal, we've already done half the length of a normal stream, so. Claw Striders, oh God. I'm trying to be sneaky and it's not working. Okay, I see what I'm wearing on the outside, but what am I wearing on the inside? I'm wearing this one on the inside. Okay, that's fine. Okay, what if we did this? This feels broadly okay. Oh gosh, what's going on here? Oh, nothing bad, I suppose. What am I looking at? Un oh, an unknown settlement, okay. That would explain why there's a lot of people here. It's a settlement. Of Shearside Climb, okay. You gotta be pretty close. I've been tracking your achievements. There's coils. So I think you're you're looking like you're getting there. Okay, so this was not quite as exciting as I thought it was. But at the same time, it's nice to know it's there. How are you, um, how are you liking it now that you're so far in? I think we talked about it, but, oh, I'm going the wrong freaking way, but I wonder if there's salmon here, so we'll keep going. Um, you were saying that you were still getting some enjoyment out of it, even though you had seen a lot of the story before, because that was my one concern, was, like, maybe it wouldn't land as hard if you had seen it, but. Let's see if there's salmon here. I'm not showing anything. I mean, there's a lot of stuff. Oh, the no, there's fish. There's salmon. Just needs salmon. another one in here somewhere grab or, or do this one I guess catch salmon okay salmon bone okay cool I think that's what I needed for my now for the bomb satchel I need three owl feathers okay But I also need another salmon bone. Okay, so I need, I need more salmon bones to get all of the things. But now at least we know where there's another set of salmon. So that's good. Um, I need to go in this direction. Okay, got it. Hey, 
Hey Kathleen, welcome back. You haven't missed much, we just got started here. Uh, you realize you had missed a lot of the story after exploring Zero Dawn base? Oh, that makes sense. Like, all of the Cradle stuff back in the All Mother Mountain was very new. It was very sad. Yes, for sure. Those humans did not have any Apollo information? Yup. They were children, even though they were young adults. Yup. Yup. So you are still getting some kind of- some reveals. Yeah, it's easy to miss either if you just missed part of the stream, um, when I was- going or if um it's also easy to just miss right like you're watching the stream and you step away for a second and that's like the time i find something or whatever what have you so i'm glad you're still getting something out of playing it i mean like obviously i got a lot out of it and i was replaying it so there was a few there was a few things i picked up on the second time i played that i hadn't the first time So I guess there's no reason that I should assume that you wouldn't get anything out of it, but still. It's such a beautiful game. And the way everything just kind of weaves into each other. It's so cool. And like, not even just beautiful in the way I'm always saying, oh, this game's so beautiful, but I mean, like, literally, the, the story is just one of the best stories in science fiction I've ever experienced. Like, not even just in video games. One of the best science fiction stories I've ever experienced. Okay. Got it. Sorry. I'm not necessarily out to get owls as much as, uh, I need owl parts for one of the satchels I'm trying to get. We yeah, the the losing of Apollo was huge, and um, that's gonna tie into this game because the um, what you what you call it the group Eurovision. Um, if they are either from the spaceship themselves. Or they are, um, they're either from, or they're descended from it or something, then they would have a copy of Apollo. Because Eliz uh, Elizabeth got, uh, the cryo chambers for the cradles by trading them Apollo. Yeah, I don't remember what they're called. I, they're Eurovision. They're Eurovision. <laughs> you know what I'm, you know what I mean? That's, it's good enough. Um, oh, I did not kill the one I wanted to kill. Oh, well. Um, so I think that it's, uh, okay, those are the rebels. So that it's going to tie in, because I think we might be able to get, I'm wondering if this game is going to let us get Apollo. Because they may have a copy of Apollo. Okay, I need to check on this. I don't think this is my... Oh, this is my stealth ranged. Never mind, I take it all back. Oh, that's the... Okay. I thought I was looking at the rebel base and I, I wasn't. That's the rebel base. Okay. <sighs> Do a little... Do a little roll around. But yes, when um, Pharaoh, I mean, you know this now because you've been to the things, but f when Pharaoh, uh, you were you were on my stream, right? When Pharaoh uh, took care of the other alphas. That's when we lost Apollo, or at least the Earth copy of Apollo. Aloy, I would like you to, to go there. Okay. Can I get up and around? Oh, there's one of the owls I needed. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. 
It's so wild to me, too, because the Eurovision peeps in this are uh, <laughs> such a small part of the first game. Like, it's almost a throwaway thing that... It, it like when I played it, it really felt like. And then we tried space just because some people playing the game might go, but did they try space? And so then they're like, well, I guess we have to add trying space just to appease them. What's that? Chill water canister. Okay. There's a lot of guys in here. we got they're very rowdy like I don't think I tagged him sons of Prometheus operative okay out of sight. I like it when they're just kind of like, I'm pretty sure I got shot by an arrow, but I can't prove it. That's the leader. He's got the shield. Can't see, like, at all. Being spotted. By who? Whomst? Whomst spotted you? I don't think that's real. Does not help that with the sun I cannot see anything. Perhaps I will move. Perhaps a different angle will allow me to actually see what's happening. Saram guy. I've already stuck a couple arrows into you. There we go. That finally did something. We're getting dangerously close to falling off this mountain. They're all looking for me, so they've run up to the side of the mountain. <laughs> means I can't shoot any of them. <laughs> Woohoo, nice. Oh god. That was fun. That's the leader guy right there. He has no idea where I am, so his shield is not- now he kind of has an idea of where I am. That's fine. Hello, I don't have you tagged. I see more of them running around too that I haven't tagged. Oh-ho! Get you out of cover and then shoot you. There we go. Led him the right amount that time. Hi. Oh, -ho! 
Shooting you, isn't that obvious? Ugh. Oh, that'll do it. Okay. Do, 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 do. Don't have a helmet and I'm... Okay, who's shooting explosive arrows at me? You. Okay, apparently I need to lead a little high. It's not working. There we go. Leading a little high helps me out there. That was quite a bit of damage. I think it's just because of the sheer amount of distance. Got him. Almost got you. It's gonna, yeah, I was gonna say that's not gonna connect at the right spot. That did. How many are left? It's just the ones I have tagged. I don't think there's anybody else. Oh, nope. That's not. He's not tagged. And he's not tagged. There we go. Take that little helmet off. And just whittle away. Got him. Now, considering how few are left, I believe think I think we could start floating on down yes he, he went under a roof okay let's go for a ride that did not go according to plan because now I'm outside the wall and now I'm inside the wall Sergeant Devonish. He's not Devon, just Devonish. Just had to tell the civs that our troops made contact with the enemy at the northern perimeter. Room was so quiet I could hear the piss running down their pants. We're supposed to keep supplying all units, but my buddy at Ops says they've ripped through San Fran Bay like the whole flotilla was made out of cardboard. If the line breaks, we'll have to fall back to the locked power cell reserves. I'm not giving these robots more power to feed on. That person's already dead, Aloy. I'm way ahead of you. There you are. Wrong move. Ah! Did not realize. Gotcha. You're just kind of in this little nook. <laughs> Not entirely sure how I'm supposed to even get to you. You just kind of fell there. Okay. That's exciting. You're over there. You're over there. Rebel champion. Healing mobiles. All these people had a bad day because of me. It's 
Sneak, 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 sneak. Boink. That should be everybody. But it didn't tell me that was everybody, so now I'm a little suspicious. In fact, it's still playing the that wasn't everybody. Why did I get meat off of the person? Why did I get rich meat off of the person? I'm a little concerned. Slightly concerned. Ooh. Is this what they were trying to get to? Well, hello. The door looks locked. Maybe this chaos sound will open it. What these rebels are so intent on protecting. Well, hello. Also wrong. Okay, we're probably not going to do a lot of stealth range, so quick outfit change. Where's the, which one's the little profile? This one? Nah. Do this one. You know what? We'll apply the look too. I never walk around in this stuff. Let's give it, let's give it a chance. Power cell, huh? Yeah, that's not really what I want you to do, but that's fine. I would like you to tag this person. I'd like you to tag this person. Okay. No. Okay, the game's like, you don't get to tag this person. Okay. So much for not using bow and arrow in here. Don't look this way, look the other way. No one sees me. Shh, Aloy! <laughs> Don't talk yet! Okay, now you can talk.
After recovering encrypted focus following the sun's Prometheus, Alien Hopes access the data back at the base. Go to the base. Oh, okay. if I have been able to do things with the keys at the other ones and maybe this will like finally let me know how. See what we got here. Like spilling into like really bad power cells. There's a whole stockpile of them in here. So the sons of Prometheus are trying to book weapons. Could use that whole stockpile in the first game. Well, whatever it is, it uses these power cells. But it doesn't look like they figured it out. Kai, we stabilize that cell. The explosion would start a chain reaction. It'll take the bunker with it. No bunker, no power cells, no new weapons. Okay, well, before we do that, let's make sure there's nothing worth looting. Looks like there's nothing else. Just my rock. Oh, I think she's gonna run for me. Okay. Alright. So we do need to go back to the base and check on that, but that's fine. Um, we'll just uh, mosey our way on to uh, some main story. Focus our friend can tell me something useful about the sons of Prometheus. Okay, so if I head this way, this is actually we'll go this way instead. There's a lot of campfires to get, but that's okay. Rolios. curiosity unlocked okay so I can I can uh, override anything that's down there any fishies oh. anything hidden behind the, uh, the waterfall nope. what am I catching this Unno oh, an unknown settlement. Ooh, well, that's actually very intriguing. Let's, uh, let's climb. Go find that unknown settlement. yet to kill a pigeon and gain anything of value for it. I'm on the expensive arrows. So what's this place? Sky's Sentry. Mm -hmm. Maybe. What do you got for me? Just coils. Uh, I can probably sell you a bunch of stuff. Three 
restock everything. Uh, not a whole lot else going on here, though, I think. Are you going to try to talk to me about hunting grounds? Like, that's really cute. wants to run but part of me is like I don't want to fight all those things over there and the other part of me is really mad I missed that owl because uh, I need owls to think that I've already gotten this one and I don't know that I believe that. Now that I have Terra Blast arrows though, everything's better. Side quest arrow. <coughs> What's going on here? So many owls just walking on the ground. There we go. Okay. Only need one more owl feather for what I'm trying to do. What is this side quest? Hi, guy. Just hanging out here? Squad made needs help. We've got up, my friends. Wait, slow down and explain. Ken and I were heading south with supplies from assault bikes from machines attack. Okay. I left her behind so I could get help from the grove and ran straight into another machine. So your friend is still up the road fighting machines? That's what I'm trying to tell you. I'll bail her out if I can. You go on and get those reinforcements. Will do. I'm in your deck. Looks like we're gonna do this. Where is it taking me? Back up here? Okay, that's fine. You know me, I like to get sidetracked. I mean, what's the point of a game if you can't get sidetracked? That sun came up real fast. Like, real, real fast. Wait, where am I? Oh, okay. We've not really super explored over here, but I... Yeah, okay. I kind of know where I am. This is cool. This, like, ankle-high water. I'm just watching to make sure there's not fish here, but it doesn't look like there is. There is a campfire up here. Oh god, of course it's a thunder jaw! Why wouldn't there be a thunder jaw here? I bet I can find a trail with my focus. It looks like the Tanakh tried to salvage some supplies after getting attacked. Are they watching? They're running back. Mm, I'm looking for Sophie. There. Tracks from the missing Tanakh. So 
horrible sound, whatever that is. Definitely looks like the other Tanakh ran off this way. I have a feeling it's over here fighting these things. I don't know what's happening. Ah! Hey! Vitae sent me! By the ten that lump made it, I thought we were both finished. Let's clear out these machines! That didn't work. Where'd you go? There you are. I am not doing anything of value at the moment. There we go. I get you, sucker. Come on. This is not feeling very epic because I cannot seem to move worth a crap. Gotcha. There we go. Stab. That's not great. Sorry, did you need that? I don't think you did. I'm trying to focus. Can't. There's a copious amount of enemies. Can't make decisions. And it's gonna blow. Oh gosh, that hurt. Level 35! Gosh, Aloy, we have our chance. Stop the rock climbing. to try to blow one of those canisters if I can but I don't think I'm gonna be able to do another one of these boink he's gonna go down oh just barely didn't I'm glad. How are we going to take that thing down? Oh, the Apex Boss Rider? That's what's got you worried, hon? Oh, I can do a Boss Rider. I assure you, I can do a Boss Rider. Does not appear that you're acid weak, though. So we'll do this instead. Where is it? Ooh, where's the loud? No time to lose. Hey, your friend's here. <laughs> you stubborn fool. You haven't let me down yet. Less smiling, more fighting. As much as I'm confident we can handle a claw strider, it is still a claw strider, and we should focus. Oh! That hurt a little bit. Step. Boing. Step. 
Boy. Stab again. Oh, I'm sorry you didn't want your tail, did you? You did it! I can't believe I'm alive. Okay. Let's not aggro the Thunderjaw. How about that? What if we didn't aggro the Thunderjaw? I think a good plan is not aggroing the Thunderjaw. Just a thought. A word before you move on. I mean, I was looting, but that's fine. If you hadn't shown up, I would have been machine gun. All I did was give your friend here a little time to You're full of it. I barely escaped with my life on foot. That I believe. I uh hope some of your supplies are still usable. Me too. Food's always scarce. The soldiers at the grove need the rations. No way we can trek back north to salt bike to get more. I'll get this one back on her feet and we'll scrape what's left of our haul. Mm, you're making me hungry. Thanks, Why? Commander. We won't forget what you did. Stay safe, both of you. All right, let's see what else we have around here to collect. Not much. All right, whatever you guys do, don't get into a fight with a Thunderjaw. Just my piece of advice. Okay. You know, I have like a buttload of skills I haven't used. Um, one of them, somewhere around here was a skill I was trying to upgrade. Like one of these ultimates. Was it this one? No, it was not this one. Was it this one? Mm, yes, this one. I got my shield back. We'll upgrade that one. And then there was another one that I was also working on that's really good. Is it this one? No, I mean, that is also a good one. But no. Where did it go? Oh no, there's one I already upgraded, and then I was upgrading that one, I think. I think that's what was happening. Yeah, this one I already upgraded. Um, okay. We should move along this track, I think. Hold and release. Yeah, I like that. I'm not as into this one, but I need it to be able to unlock this. Anyway, now we've spent some points. God raise. So many god rays. You know, to talk about Frostpunk 2 a little bit more, why we're getting places. Um, what's interesting about it is it feels more of like what they call a macro city builder. Where Frostpunk 1 felt more of what they call a micro city builder. And I'm not sure it's going to ultimately feel that way. Once I get everything unlocked. Raiders? Raiders. Where am I exactly? Here. Okay. Oh, I'm not gone. I 
I assure you of that. Y'all don't know where I am. You just know that I shot somebody in the head. Where'd she go? Oh, gee, I don't know. Where could I be? Hell, it's not gonna do you much good now. We don't need to hook. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Revenge! You'll pay in blood. Will I? Will I pay in blood? Are you sure about that? I no longer have eyes for you. This is not a close combat bow, but I used it as one. Alright. I don't know what y'all were doing out here, but now whatever it is, you're not doing it anymore. See, this is why I don't like to fast travel on my way back to story missions, because I feel like that's where they hide the fun stuff. Duck, I needed that. Got him. Duck is one of the ones that I'm missing stuff from. And I got it! So I can make the trap pouch now. Whenever I get to a workbench. So I should check and see. Is there anything else? Still need some parts from the owls. That's a tree. We got a big something up here. What are we looking at? Oh good, Apex Ravager. Because a regular Ravager isn't enough. Let's just restock a bunch of stuff here. I need some plasma weapons, that is one thing I don't have, like, anything of. Big kitty. I don't think I can override you. But you- I can. <laughs> We're gonna override the Ravager. Go, Panther Kitty. You don't need your gun. Get the kitty. You 
have not lost your gun, which is frustrating. Now it's off. Oh yeah, I guess you're a little bit mad at me, huh? Ow! Oh, and then I died. I thought I was doing so good. I guess I wasn't. How far back we going? Not too far back. I might not be in the best armor for Ravager hunting. Where's the other one? We all know there's two over here. Go back to this one. Oh, actually, that's probably a mistake because I think they use plasma. Is the other one not here? What level are you? 32? Yeah, it's a little too close to my level. We'll just skadoot. There's something over there. an area with ducks, I guess. Which, honestly, I think is anything around here. I think this is a duck-laden area. Probably not here. We probably need to be closer to the water. I wonder if this is a separate duck or if because I died it undid my previous progress. Whoa! That was some sunrise. That came up fast. kind of taking me in the general direction of where I want to go, so that's fine. I have a feeling that this is where my quest that I'm about to go turn in is going to happen, because this looks very meeting of the fighting. So it claims this is a duck area. That would be a duck. Gotcha. They're very cool looking ducks. Food pouch. Nope, it was a separate duck item. That's great. Food pouch is something I would very much like to upgrade. So now is it taking me, it's going to take me there, okay. We're going to sneak through the area. I 
broadly know where we are now. Sure is. All right, let's see. Is there anywhere around here that has a workbench? Not really. Well, let's go talk to this weapon or weapon ear person real quick. Ooh, beam wire. I remember that, but I'd have to have a slither thing. Circulator. You don't really have anything that I want. Well, that I can afford, I should say. You have something that I want. I just can't afford it. How far do I need to go in? Okay, not there. I need to go around. Let's, uh, let's change up the look. I don't really want to look like a taru. Actually, that's not what I wanted. We're going to equip this one. We're going to look this one. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Kotaro await you within. That's cool. to the starting seat. Once it's done, I'll be able to access the chamber below Hikaru's throne. Is there anything... Are you the only one listening to these voices? Oh, no. The others who captured the Osaram Delver heard the voices from these ancient warriors, too. They spread the word, and now a lot of people are talking about them. <laughs> Soldiers are interested in old battles. I have some more of the voices you're looking for. I'm sure I can learn more. I'm assuming that I get one for each one, right? Like, I'm assuming that... I'm assuming that... Well, I guess I don't really know what I want, though. This is why I was here before, too. I'm like, oh, God, I don't know what I want. Let me know when you want to trade for I definitely want to. I just don't know what I want. You know if I find more voices. I just I don't know if it's like there's one for each thing, so I really don't have to make a decision or if I need to be careful. Outlander, the chief awaits you in the arena, past the throne. Yeah. We're running out to where we were. It's just you have to come this way first. We're just going to jump over the throne because that's how much I care right now. This must lead to the arena. Looks like my instincts are correct. upper part. This is the lower part. Hey, Lord. It seems you've had to move mountains to bring us comfort and peace. Kataro helped. Yes. Takote reprimanded for all the clans of the East. Both good and bad. But now the Kuru is at hand. Some I'll do whatever it takes to hold up my end, as long as you are nibbling yours. So what's the plan? Katalo. There are only two viable ways to attack the arena. Through the throne room you just passed, 
and by the trail on the north end. We've set up barricades at both. But if Regala means to assault the cool with his machines, he will have to attack by the trail. You will join our defenders there. I can do that. Hold the line. Preparations you must. Once the cool route begins, you must see it through. I know where I'll be. What about you two? I will be here with the chief, where I belong. Should the fight reach us, we will take the blood owed for our father. If it comes to that, the defense is your hold. Let's get started. Good. You'll find Decca at the north barricade with the rest of our defenders. Yeah. Strike true as they can. I'll see you in the room. There's armor in that chest where you can take it. Take okay. It. If you insist. Neck martial armor. Alright, let's see what we got here. Oh, this is nice looking. I mean, it's kind of weird, but it's cool. Stealth tear, heavy weapon. Interesting. This weapon. Yeah, this stuff's. This armor is better, I think. I don't know what this one does. You said, right, I still have to pry open. I don't know, I feel like this looks better and does more, but that could also be because I haven't put stuff in here. I'm trying to decide what I want to go out there with. Card of Shadow Armor might not be bad, actually. And for good measure, let's equip it. Just to piss off uh, Regala. I want to go down there. Can I go? Can I go down there? I guess not. There's not like other armor I haven't gotten, right? Okay. Ah, a workbench. That's actually something I really wanted. Pouch upgrades. Okay. Um. Food pouch. Means I, I can't do that one, which is fine. Light arrow. And trap pouch. Okay, so looking at this. Can't do that because we haven't found any of those things yet. This is fully upgraded. Haven't found pelicans yet. We can work on that one. Haven't found those things yet, a lot of those things yet. Uh, haven't found bass or crab yet. Haven't found those things. I haven't found bass yet. I found pelicans yet. I haven't found moonfish yet. Okay. So there's nothing really else to look for at this time. Now, this tenac. Okay, this is not expensive, so let's go ahead and just do this. See if this gets better. Sunwing shield caster. Claw strider sack. Uh, you know what? I'll give up these things. Keep it going. Get the low health defense. See, this is going to become much better because I'm actually going to be able to upgrade this a fair amount. Okay. So now I'm actually feeling like this might be pretty good to wear. I just don't want to use green shine on blue things. Inventory. I like that they're called outfits instead of armor. I feel like it's a little condescending. Okay. Um, can I counteract some of the electricity stuff? Or do I just not care about electricity and do I lean in on something else? We can up arrow damage. That might not be bad. Okay, now I'm feeling like this is pretty good. 
So let's give this a shot. And you know what? Screw it. We'll dress like this weird, with this weird fish hat. I, I feel like, I don't know what I am. I, I, I look like a T-Rex fish. I'm, I'm not entirely sure how I feel about this. God bless you. Did somebody just sneeze? Why are you all sneezing? Could be an awesome sports arena with the walls and the crater and everything. Would totally see a game here, 10 out of 10. But bring in a hot dog stand and a lot more bathrooms. Also a roof and AC. Man, it's hot here. Not even noon. I mean, why are they all sneezing? I feel like that's a valid question. Shut <laughs> a joke. <laughs> you're, you know, you're right. Hey. If there's a chance, my challenge is that you face me at Gala. It's only right that Commander join in the fate. Or maybe you need to save face after what happened with the bulwark. Careful now. Sometimes sharp wits bring out sharp spears. I'd save my spear for Regala's troops. The pink guys are my favorite look. I don't really know enough about their culture other than their leader's a dick. But I think they're my favorite look. Am I supposed to go up there? Ah, ladder. I was like, there's no way they're making me walk all the way around. Zero percent chance. Focus on the machine. Take them Although these guys look pretty cool too. And Regala's forces become no Man, she has a lot of balls. Yes, Chaplain. Watch each other's backs. Dismissed. Soldiers are ready. They will defend the cool route from below. But from above. My car, lady. Where did you get it? One of our squads ripped it off a fallen machine. The honor is yours. Regala may have her tricks, but you will show her our teeth. Works for me. Yeah, I don't. That's the thing. It's like a weird fish hat. It's a little disconcerting. I really liked it until I saw the eyes. One from the desert, one from the sky, three from the jungle. Shall be named Marshall. Remember the ten. Strike from the air as they did, and see your glory. There they go. Don't get distracted, girl. She's coming. Ravagers. 
You know, if we're out here also fighting machines, I feel like everyone out here is also qualified to be a marshal. Oh man, this is nice, whatever this is. almost empty. What happens when it's empty? Do I just have to go down and fight? Okay. Ah, there's more. Got it. I'm gonna focus on the Ravenger, I think. Oh, I didn't need to do that. Triceratops. Something else coming, Claw Strider. Oh, you just appeared out of nowhere, quite literally. Working on it. Almost got him. Almost got him. More weapons around the sides. You know, before I use... Okay, I guess you're still pretty. else coming? Come out here. is coming. There's no way that's it. Zero percent chance that's it. Not for something this big. Oh god, it's not- oh, I hate these! Wait, if she doesn't know then it's not what I think it is. It's not a rock breaker, is it? Breaker, or is it something worse? Watch out! Rock Breaker! A nasty one! Alright! I hate these suckers! Let's take this thing down! Oh, hi! It's a Trojan Rock Breaker! It's a slither fang. Get to the weapon. If I can 
I'm gonna hit it with a rock! water at me. Hold on. What has purge water defense? This one does. Hold on, no. I don't think it actually... Yeah. Oh no. I just can't read. We're fine. Oh god. Okay, that did, like, next to nothing. You know what? Aha! Nice try! Ow. Get it! Supposed to get it. Hit it. Come on. God, that hurt. Okay, good thing I had that shield on. Okay, I think I need to get it near the tower so they'll shoot at it. Come over here. No more shield. Okay, good. Hold on, We're okay, they're doing some damage to it. I just have to not die. Well, that's not how you not die. I, I'm trying to get you to take a potion. Oh! Missed me! Oh! I knocked the snake down! Stab! Stab it so much! Stab it so much, Aloy! Oh, electricity! Hit you with this boomerang. He's so close. They almost got it. Come on, guys. Oh, whiff. In the face! Ugh. They're gonna be like, Aloy, you should be a marshal. I better get the loot. Convenient, it crashed a ramp down for me. Coming. Got it. 
I'll get to the chief. I'm not entirely sure where that is, but I'll get to him. Bode! They're not in honor combat, I'm allowed to help. I was like, am I really gonna just pull this myself? Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. No! drop a building on you. I don't think that worked. You are outnumbered, lady. Time to scoot. Is no one going to shoot her with an arrow? I'll be back with everything I have. An arrow. Someone with an No, I I have arrows. I have arrows. No one, no one with the arrows. Okay. It's, it's fine. Pay attention. That wasn't important. You fought well. Prove yourself against enemies both metal and flesh. I name you all Martian. Your first order is to secure the arena from any remaining rebels. Go. <laughs> Plot armor strikes again. No, you've done enough. Far more than our bargain called for. When we first met, you spoke of your true mission on which all depends. I wasn't certain if I believed you then. But I believe you now. Believe me. And get to your task. Tend to the wound. Deeds today will be remembered like those of the ten. It's just a button. I couldn't have figured that out sooner. Heck yeah. Gosh dang it, Aloy. We'll just do it this way. This is pretty wild looking. What, what is that? I guess this is stuff they've put in. Let's have a little looky woo first. Terrence Goodman to Steve Perkins. WTH Perkins? Ever participated in a cluster without ever partition the probably never partition the cluster without telling me again. We had power surges all over the place, including one in the main building at 831 PM, right when Director Kadori was headed out for the night. The gold mountain hollow lit up from total darkness right as she walked by. And it scared the living taillights out of her. She was pissed, dude. What are you trying to do? Get us all... We're in a server room. I like how it's the server room, but they've made it look like a tomb. Parkins! Dang it, Parkins! Why are you doing this like that, Parkins? a cool room. Come on, Aether. Time to go home. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring Aether subordinate function to original code. Got it. Now 
get this back to Gaia. Return to base. The vision that Chief Hikaru saw years ago. All of the visions are changed, and this one just arrived. The visions throughout the grove are different now, and this one, it, it just appeared. Is this your doing? Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. But Hikaru needs you. Because he needs a hand. New marshals. And the rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. So I will stand with you on your mission. Give whatever is left of my life. It is what I choose. So, there's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. We're collecting people! Go to the mountains, west of Plainsong. A friend of mine will meet you on the ascent. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours? Should be interesting. That was cool. It seems like Capture will get something to another hologram as soon. I gave it checking out. Looks like there's some side quests. Okay, so there's some stuff to do in here. I'm gonna use the uh, restroom. I think we've read this before. Yeah, we've read this before. I'm gonna use the restroom and then we'll work our way through. Uh, and do here, head towards the base, um, and collect all of that. Just let me. Uh, Take care of some things and I'll be right back.
All right, I am back. I have snack. We're ready to go. We can explore. I have a lot of side quests too, and we're just gonna get more here. So I feel like the next time we stream this, will be a lot of side quests filling in. See what's going on over here. Sorry, didn't mean to jump on your head. It's just your head was in my way. All these are working again. All right, Cockatoo, what you got for me? Blood of the ten, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. <laughs> now we just have to remember them, though. <laughs> And hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A personal one. My grandson, mm -hmm. Kazu. He was not counted among the dead. Which means okay. he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner. No. He joined one village. Oh. Many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task, so my blade is a lonely one. Unless you'd be willing to join me. Sure as heck would. Much to ask after all you've done. No, it's not. It's a side quest. I want to do it. Is the last of my you said Kavo is your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans war constantly with each other. Every skirmish claimed another time. One by one, I buried my children. And then, they killed them. She's had a rough one. Sorry. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield, but I never found comfort there. Only in the wisdom of the visions. And even so, I still couldn't prevent Cavo from following the trail of blood. What made Kavo join Regala's rebellion? For some, Regala represents a chance of vengeance against the Kaiser. During the Red Rage, it wasn't easy to turn the clans back at Baron Light. Many wanted to pursue the Kaiser all the way to the Meridian. So when Regala attacked the embassy, they took it as a call to arms. Yes. But others, the young especially, care only about the glory they think they'll earn by hunting an age-old enemy. Kavo. He's probably a bit of both. And a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing I said could stop him. So if Kavo didn't listen to you when he joined the rebels, what makes you think he will now? Kavo was too young to fight during the Red Rage. Nor was a stranger to him. But he must have experienced the suffering it brings by now. He will listen. Just have to find him before it's too late. If Kavo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. The rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. Then you have to try. I'll help you find your grandson. Where do we start? 
while back, our scouts reported Cabo's squad left one of Rodale's outposts in the hills to the south. This squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Cabo's squad is. <coughs> some other things to take care of first. I can meet you there. I'll wait for you on the hill crest southeast of the grove. We'll make our way to the outpost from there. Until then, strike through. Strike through. <laughs> I love these guys. Like, it was so interesting to me because they kept using the phrase bag and tag. I'm like, there is no way anyone in this world knows what the phrase bag and tag means. And then it turns out it's because they follow, like, the uh the museum of like a military unit i'm like okay that makes so much more sense champion i fear we need to lean on your strength and generosity again okay just tell it to her straight decker the tribe needs the arena she's our only hope to getting it open again we need the arena but the cool is over that's true, but we also use the arena to boost the tribe's morale. We use it for training, herding machines so our soldiers can experience the glory of the kills in a controlled setting. Which, of course, boosts morale. But Chief Hikaru won't let us reopen the arena until the ballista protecting the field is repaired. We need ah. it in case a machine runs amok, and it was damaged during the coolies. The parts we need aren't easy to find. Sounds like a fetch quest. Then we need to hunt down some machines and grab the parts. We'd ask someone else, but every squad in the Grove is on alert. But the task is not without compensation, right, Kala? Of course. Once the arena is open again, I would be honored to invite you to compete. A wide variety of machines will be available. And I will award you prizes for victory. Not Heck just yeah. from the arena, but also from medals won at hunting grounds. <coughs> we'll be able to trade them for some of the Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This year. We gotta get, get this open. We'll need a sinew from a roller runner, along with some bristleback tusks. I might have some of these things. Kinds of machines have been spotted near a campfire to the southeast. When you're done, bring the parts to me at the maw of the arena, on the northeast side of the grove. Okay, I'll see what I can do. One more thing. If you're going back into the wild, I have another duty tied to our soldiers' morale. A regrettable one. Oh? Every Tanakh soldier carries a tag carved with their squad symbol. Rebels have been hoarding the tags of the soldiers they kill. You might find such tags at any enemy outpost. If you I have found some. Bring them to me. I'll make sure they're returned to the soldier squad mates and loved ones. Having confirmation sometimes soothes their grief. And there are bounties involved, if that matters to you. I've already found some of those tags. I don't have anything to pay you with here. Bring them to me at the Maw of the Arena when you can. Thank you, champion. And please don't forget the parts for the ballista. Oh, we will be doing this for sure. Okay. Anything else around here? Uh, some unknown things. It's probably more shops. Let's go back in. Let's try to figure out what those are. Guess I need to head southeast to find that roller bar. I already have enough bristleback tusks on me. That answered some of my questions. Potions. A chef. Blood bread. Oland trail mix. Concentration region. Oh, that's good. Fire cloth stew. The great MRE. Um, not more than an hour, but possibly less. I'm mostly just seeing what's here, and then we're going to go back to the base.
But that's mostly due to, uh, dealing with, uh, uh, bedtime. I am already great. Okay, this is the same lady as before. But now I have a Slither Fang Circulator. I wanted to get this one. I'll think about it. Alright. So we'll head back towards the base. Part of me thinks we shouldn't just fast travel in case something's going on there. But part of me is like, this is really far away. We'll just go here. Walk up from here. But we should get some story stuff here. We'll be somebody new at the base. Possibly Aaron and Barrow will have shown up. Are we gonna give Herico a, a focus? Cause I feel like he's gonna really freak out once he learns what technology is. There's my boys. You're not waving a hammer around, Aaron. Try a gentler touch. And my big sausage fingers don't really do gentle, okay? <laughs> Trace the line to your right. Other right. I just saw it. The one Aloy found up north. Gotcha. They call it a concussion beat <laughs> <or something. laughs> it's the thing That's from frozen wilds Aloy. Aaron. That's so effing funny and you're here that was the best thing the ever only goes on you can do your thing we learn concrete beach party that you want all the backup you can get right we still have much training to do one does not become hunter and king. Each seed grows at a pace of its own. Doesn't mean it won't bloom. You should know your Tanakh friend around. Katolo. I heard they're warriors drink people's blood. I want to sleep with one eye open. I think you've seen enough blood for a life. I showed him some <laughs> of the ruins. He seems to appreciate the privacy. <coughs> Looks like you've got things under control. I should get this to Gaia. Right. We'll keep on training. Catch up as fast as we can. I'm seeing glyphs in my dreams already. Well, while you've been off gallivanting around, I've been working with Gaia to find out more about the land birds. So, from where I'm standing, you're in need of some training. Come along. <laughs> We're just gonna shrug. All right. Aaron, how are you doing? I was hoping you could help me with something. It's about the Tanakh brothers, and also has to do with the Osir. Really? That doesn't sound good. Let me know what I can do to help. Zenith, that's what they're called. Yeah, Varl's been helping me get the lay of the land. 
when he's not getting all tongue-tied. I don't know who makes him more nervous, that Gaia lady or our new Utaru lady. Well, what about the Vanguard? Aren't you supposed to be back east, ordering them around? I sent some of them back to you, but you knew the message. I doubt a bot will mind you sticking around to help the savior of Meridian. <laughs> Met our new Tanakh friend. He's uh quiet. <laughs> Thought his people were supposed to be bloodthirsty maniacs. He shouldn't believe everything he hears. Yeah. Well, I guess if you trust him, so do I. So Talana came by the base? Yeah, more like rushed through. I was hoping she'd stay for a drink at least. <laughs> Good, we can get this uh, quest going. I like her. I see you've all gave you a focus. That uh, doesn't look as fashionable on me, but by the forge, the things I've been able to see. Granted, a lot of them are bad, you know, old world emblem and such. I'm still trying to wrap my head around most of it, but I never really understood how you were ever able to find my sister back in the sun. Yep. You are useful. Yeah. Hey, Loy. The man's trying. I guess you know what we're up against by now. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. When Varl first told me those bastards come from the stars, I thought he'd eaten too many of those medicinal berries. Yeah, but I've gotten used to seeing impossible things, thanks to you. I just wish they weren't always trying to kill us. <laughs> year we stopped Durval and his cronies from blowing up Meridia in retribution for the Red Wolf. Yep. Now you're telling me we have another group of Osaram trying to wipe out the Karja with, with an army of machines and bloodthirsty Tanakh? Yep. Well, that's just great. <laughs> Aaron. Anything to track them down and stop them. Well, I could have the Vanguard check the chain scrapes and bound light. But if they are, they're being tested. Yeah. And their focus is too. Seems like the integrity of gods is a trail. Hold on. Uh, way back when we first met, you came looking for me in Meridian because you detected Olin's focus with yours, right? Mm -hmm. Does that mean that if I go back to the Daunt with this, you could scan for our focuses? If an Osiram is wearing one of these, they'd have to be a part of that Prometheus group. That's not a bad idea. Why do you wear them? <laughs> it's hard to know if you find anything. You got it. Aw, Aaron. Let me know if you find any sons of Prometheus in the Daunt. I'll keep scouting those rebel camps. Be careful. What's this? <coughs> I'll take stuff. I'd like that. Holograms. Gaia, I thought you said the data here was lost. I was able to repurpose the equipment to store the data you have acquired in your travels. So can I do something in here or is it just a pretty room? Swamp facility. Well, I've seen pretty interesting in space travel, but this is not a keepsake. Hmm. Ah. See how they changed everything in here? <laughs> Looks like Aaron and Katala moved their stuff in. Interesting. I'm assuming Talana will be here too once we eventually finish her quest. Check 
can also count our co-owned machines to put your spell behind when she sets you free. Guess I just better stand with a good guy. I should go to my room and check out the focus I found in that wedding cap. I guess this is our room. I should be able to help. There. Mm. Got you. Oh, that was that. Aloy, it seems you've recovered some property that did Silence! Am I not surprised to see you? You know, after you tried to sell me out to the Zenith at the Hades Proving Lab? Hardly. When I realized the lone hunters had been awaiting Regala's camps, I knew you had escaped. Subtlety is not your strong suit. <laughs> Again? Understand, silence, is that you doled out machine overrides to dangerous people and stoked up a tribal civil war. Again. Congratulations. I'm glad I stopped it. Fine. Stubbornly blundering ahead as usual. Your efforts will only slow the inevitable. A warning, though. The signs of Prometheus are very tenacious. And if they go off your head, there's nothing I can do about that now. What will I do without your protection? You should be scared, Aloy. More than you realize. But I have better things to do than educate you. <laughs> These. These two. Ow. <laughs> I love them. I'm gonna shut that arrogant mouth of his. Permanently. <laughs> I have to figure out why he's doing what he's doing. Oh. Looks like someone's rearranged stuff in here. Aloy, I see you found your room. Your companions thought you would appreciate a private space of your own. I was thoughtful of them. This is the rite of passage that the Shire gave me at the embassy. What else we got here? My old spear. OG spear. Does she say the same thing again or something new? He'd believe you, Aloy. He'd believe in you. Regala's attack at the embassy. The more she's ambushed and surrounded, killed one by one. Reminds me of the massacre of the Great Echo. Back on the sacred lands. So many lives wasted. For what? She already would be. Probably all part of some master plan, huh? 
guess when you are good at working those. Dance straight. <laughs> I have to go. I guess it's back to reading. <laughs> into that archive room with the focuses you gave us we'll be able to access it at our own pace you know learn and train and if you need it we'll be there to fight at your side got it thanks Bob. looks like i was wrong about the xenix their ship didn't explode on its way to sirius like everyone thought we saw how they lied about creating a better future at their launch facility why would they lie though? What's the advantage? That's what I don't get. I get that they're not truthful. But what do they gain by lying to a planet that they thought was going to die? <laughs> I can already. I'd be a fool to refuse her help. Of course. <laughs> you guys reading something over there? We just finished going through all the logs you collected back in Nora territory and all Mother Mountain. It's hard to imagine that my ancestors were trapped inside without the knowledge to follow their guidance. Thanks to Ted Farrow. Yeah. I wonder how it must have felt when they were finally free. The world must have seemed Terrifying. Yeah. No much more than kids. With no survival skills. An entire tribe. <coughs> uh, you've spoken with Katala? I wanted to pay my respects for those who fell when we were ambushed at the embassy. I told him I'd never seen anyone throw themselves at a machine like you did. He said a warrior shouldn't be praised for fulfilling their duty. For a second, I thought I was talking to my mother. <laughs> So much in common. I'm guessing Talana didn't stay for long. You got that right. Makes you wonder what this Amadis guy did to grab her attention. Whatever it was, she didn't tell me. Must be quite a story. I guess she'll tell us when she's ready. How's everyone handling their focus? And we all have our difficult moments. Aaron is definitely perfect. But I'm hoping Osterum's stubbornness prevails. How's everyone doing? Just taking it all in. No one snapped their bowstrings yet. Think you can hold the fort while I'm gone? If Aaron stops listening to the same music over and over again, maybe. <laughs> be fine. He's about to go out on a mission. About his training partner. Learning is best done together. Mm -hmm. So you've settled in. Gaia did say this place was built for us, so we could regain control of our lands with her. It's a terraforming system. Nurture them like the land gods do plain sailors' field. It does strike me as odd that a place of life should have so much. You've spoken with Katala? A few words. Tanakh don't have much use for us outsiders. We must have made quite the impression for him to offer his fealty. You've been getting to know Erend, I assume? Of course. Any friend of Varl's is a friend of mine. In this case, a very loud friend. <laughs> I shall return to our training then. I'm trying to find Katalo. Looks like someone's made this space their own. Looks like you found Varl and Zoe's room. 
Oh, it's their room. Never mind. Oh, gosh, I shouldn't have skipped over that dialogue. Didn't realize it was going to end it. They've been getting cozy. I'm not sure I'll ever fully understand, but seeing something that represents life and prosperity traded through a weapon couldn't be easy for Zal. Found you. He does have a focus. So that's gonna be wild. It's good to see you. I'm guessing you've got a lot of questions. I've been told of our enemy and their intentions. Your friends showed me to the vision of your keep in this place. Gaia, and gave me this focus. I, I don't pretend to fully understand everything, but all I really need to know is where to train and when to fight. Welcome to the team, then. You've had some time with the team now. Any thoughts? I admit, I was surprised to see Mutaru here. Farmers don't make for effective soldiers. I'm told she rallied some in her tribe against the Karja, and fought all the way to their alliance. Interesting. Perhaps I'm mistaken. Wouldn't be the first time, apparently. Now that you know who the enemy is, do you have any questions? I'll admit, I find them hard to grasp. From the heavens. And in form. For now. I will leave the strategy to you. I trust you will point my blade where it will cut the deepest. What are you looking at over there? The others have been helping me decipher the symbols the focus showed me. So, I thought I'd try to understand the weapon you intend to use against the enemy. <coughs> Answer to Gaia? Yes. Yep. How many? That's many. That's what we need. Much power. Has the world ever seen the like? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's gonna have a problem. Feel free to check in on Hikaru and your people. Doors always open here. I will. May the ten walk with you. We salute now. Sack weapon. Which I had, but I spent it on uh, upgrades. Because they were upgrades I very much wanted. Okay. To the groundskeeper, what quest do I have active? Oh, yeah, no, this is not the one we need. This is the one we need. Okay, there we go. Gaia! Welcome back, Aeon. When you're ready, please merge Ito with me. Afterwards, I must discuss an important matter with you. What did you want to discuss? While you were away, I received an unusual transmission on my dedicated Alothia frequency. Alothia? That's one of the sub-functions you couldn't detect before. Yes. The transmission occurred so slowly that at first it seemed like an accidental blip of data amongst background static. Once I noticed this irregularity, it took some time to correlate the complete message. Am I going to have more fetch quests?
SOS. Where does it lead? In the mountain to the northwest of this facility. A word of caution here. It is possible this transmission is genuine. It is also possible it is being broadcast by someone or something else. You don't True. Think it's actually Alicia? I am uncertain. What's SOS? It is an old world code, a distress signal, a desperate plea for help. <clears throat> Why would Aluthia send a coded transmission on a frequency only the two of you can communicate on? I believe it was done as a precaution to avoid detection, or at least to create the appearance of the desire to do so. That might be white so suspicious. Either Aluthia is in trouble and sent the message hoping you were out there, or someone else is trying to get us to go to these coordinates, pretending to be Aluthia. That is my conclusion as well. Could the Zenith be sending a transmission? Could be silence. The data I reviewed on your focus, the Zeniths recovered the other Gaia Moat kernel from the Hades Proving Lab. to my internal frequencies. So, maybe they sent it thinking you'd respond and reveal your location. Possibly. However, the transmission is highly irregular. If they intended to provoke me into revealing myself, I would expect the communication to be more routine. Right. So maybe it's not them that I'm Oh, there's only one way to find out. lead to a mountain to the northwest. What's there? I have no record of anything of note in that vicinity. Okay, then what about the other number in the message? 237. Any idea what that means? I have queried my available databases, but it does not appear to have any significance. Perhaps its meaning can only be understood at the indicated coordinates. It might be a door code. I'll go to the coordinates and check out the source of the transmission. All by yourself? Ha! No way. I included Aaron and Barb in this briefing via their focuses. I concur that you should not investigate this alone. What if it's a trap? Of course it could be a trap. We gotta take the boys! Luthier, then it's in trouble, and I need to bring it back. Don't worry. I'll be careful and... We're coming with you. Take the boys. Fine. Go grab your things. We'll wait for you at the west exit, in case you need to upgrade your gear. Ta da! Well, it's probably a good place to leave it. Uh did a decent amount of things. Oh, so see, everything's on hold until we do this. Okay. That's fine. Where's it sending us? Won't tell me until we get out of the house. That's fine. So I'll probably leave it here. Um, in terms of being able to stream next, probably not tomorrow. I don't think. Um, I know for a fact not Thursday, probably not tomorrow. So I'm hoping for Friday, hoping for Friday. If Friday doesn't work out, then my plan is to just play this a bunch on Saturday and we'll make some pretty good advancements into it. Um, just sick of wearing these things. What is this? Cause if I interacted here, what do I do here? What is this? It is a control point for a drone-based energy system connected to this dome. Oh, cool. I will transmit the relevant data to your focus. Hmm. So this 
Cyclops is a network of drones to monitor the deteriorating biosphere conditions. Guess it was meant to display in the dome, but the drones aren't connected anymore. We've been finding the drones. We can make some of them already. But it seems like there are more out there. Drones reconnected now. Okay. We can finally turn these things in. I like this one. We've done four of ten. So now we can make it look cool in here. That's neat. She's saying that she has new things. Patching and Varl and Owen to our conversation. I think you accepted their help. Is there something you wish to discuss before we depart? Mm-hmm. How's Katala doing? I detect that the loss of his arm still deeply pains him, though he has not voiced his thoughts. I may be able to assist in his recovery, should he be interested. Really? I'm sure he will be. Varl and Zoe seem to like spending time together. While studying old world data, Zoe discovered references to a dietary lifestyle known as vegetarianism. She appreciated the similarities with Utaru practices and encouraged Varl to try out this lifestyle. Uh huh. So how did that go? I believe they have agreed to disagree. <laughs> How's Aaron handling things? He is becoming increasingly accustomed to use of the focus. After an initial incident. What did he do? He unfortunately crushed his first focus as he attempted to affix it to his temple. Amongst a number of Osaram curses, I believe he also blamed the focus for being dainty. <laughs> he has given repeated assurances that it will not happen again. Well, good thing. Oh, we Aaron. I love Aaron so much. Like, I really, really do. So I hate his proving lab, where I found the gynecone. It used to be a thorough research facility? Yes. Prior to appropriation by Zero Dawn, the facility was used to engineer and test advanced computer viruses. It appears to have been one of many research initiatives by Pharaoh Automated Solutions. Yeah, before it this made the virus. Killing machines. He wanted viruses to infect them with too. Which is how we got to where we were. So, <coughs> before the battle at Meridian, I went into Fanuk territory. I discovered another AI there, one not related to Zero Dawn, Cyan. It was created to oversee operations for a volcanic stabilization project, and it spent the last thousand years in isolation. I'm guessing you didn't know about it? No. From the data on your focus, it seems that Cyan was cut off from the outside world. An effort by its creators to protect it from the Pharaoh plague. Any chance it could help us now? I have already attempted contact, with no success. Given its previous experience with accepting an outside medical request, I imagine it is unwilling so again. Right. Because last time Hephaestus enslaved it. Well, that's too bad. I think the two of you would have had a lot to talk about. Yeah, well, maybe we will visit sometime until Cyan Gaia's okay. The Aether was installed on was part of an ancient war museum. A memorial to something called the Hot Zone Crisis. Do you know anything about it? 
My knowledge of historical events was unfortunately lost with the Apollo database. However, planet data indicates a peak in regional temperatures in the 2030s. Such conditions would see extreme prolonged droughts, an increase in dust storms, and a loss of habitable landmass. But they wouldn't have built the museum in the middle of a wasteland. So I guess things got better eventually. Yes. Data suggests that temperatures returned to average levels in the crawlback era of the 2040s. <laughs> there was an ancient tank in Ben. We're just we're just asking her about everything. Under a bunch of boulders. Any idea how it got there? During the Pharaoh Peak, the U.S. military resumed the use of human combatants as automated machinery unreliable. It is possible the vehicle was part of a pre-automated war fleet. So they fought against the pharaoh machines in the valley until the Nazis blasted apart and buried them. So this facility, the regional control center, it was meant to oversee the terraforming system? For the local region? humans received their education from the Apollo database, they would have then been guided here to assume operation. Has that never happened, this place remained vacant. Until Minerva decided to settle here. So I guess this room was meant to keep an eye on conditions outside? Yes. From here, the facilities operate. What's interesting is, like, she talked about regional and everything. Everything in this game is, is either game has been North America. I feel like there's room to tell other stories, like in Asia, in Europe, South America, Africa. Like, Aloy is Elizabeth Sobek. But I feel like there's room to talk about. Now there's more stuff about the old world. Oh my gosh. Oh, I see, because I've never asked about these. Okay. So, yeah, so my Faro really so messed it up. The greatest minds in the world, all working to build the terraforming system while the Pharaoh Plague devoured the planet. What was it like? Personnel worked in rotations at all hours of the day. Resources and technology were secured from across the world. Within a month of the project's conception, I was launched and began my education. Elizabeth encouraged me to spend time with the rest of the Zero Dawn staff. She said it was important to experience many personalities and perspectives. We should be back. Yeah, I was just asking questions. It looks like a crash, which is just a sign that it's time to get going here soon. Um, but I was just asking about Elizabeth and all that. Just about text. Yeah, I saw. Thanks for saying something. I saw Ray's message, but I wanted to finish listening to Gaia. Um, but she just talked about working with the Zero Dawn, Zero Dawn staff and. How much she appreciated appreciated them, and how much she appreciated Elizabeth. So it was it was good emotional stuff, but it wasn't anything super plot needed. Um, but I do think I'll take that as a sign. So I think I've talked to everybody in here now. Hmm. What one? Not this one. Not that one. Huh. The door is unlocked now. Gaia, what was this room for? This was intended to be a recreation room for control center operatives. Unfortunately, the entertainment modules were lost with the Apollo database. This probably would be a room that would do more if I had actually been playing Machine Strike, which I have not been playing. 
Nor do I have a lot of intention to do so. Well, I will get going as soon as I figure out what this is for. things. Ah. Switch to a private lock. Okay, so regional control center nine. Design of the facilities coming along. Nine. When Gaia finally builds it, it'll have everything it needs. Except personality. So I'm going to sneak in my own mark. A couple of flourishes. Starting with this little tucked away hideout. August would have gotten a kick out of it. He loved hidden passages, like the kind in old English castles. But I've got something bigger planned. My piece de resistance, if you will. <laughs> so I guess we'll continue to come in and find hidden things. That's cool. There'll probably be like little rooms inside of all of the other rooms. Like I said, if I was doing machine strike, there'd probably be stuff in here. Alright, um, I'm gonna save because otherwise as soon as I go off with Mary and Pippin over here, uh, the game's gonna move forward. So, we'll save. Uh, oh. Interesting, apparently I can't. Okay, well, I guess we'll go with them so I can get to a save point. Because <laughs> it won't let me save. The problem is, this means I won't really be able to play much until I stream again. But I didn't realize we'd get locked into this. I will say, there's... Had to be up a really steep mountain, huh? A zenith. I don't think we'll be getting into a fight because I don't have a way to beat her yet. What the hell? Oh, they killed her shield. And they killed her. And then they killed themselves. A lot just happened. Burl, see if there's anything over there. On it. We'll check out the battlefield. Let's stop at that zenith. I just want to see. Can't believe you fought one of them. Almost didn't make it. Where am I? I'm over here. Okay, I'm gonna save. Where 
Where is the... Huh. Okay. Well, I'm gonna stop then. Worst case scenario, I just have to watch that cutscene again. I can't, well, I can't save because I'm out at a campfire. You can only save at a campfire. I just kept going in here for some reason. Um, but I was trying to get to a campfire and it wouldn't let me. And so anyway, worst case scenario, I'm going to have to watch that cutscene again, right? That's going to be my save point. So I'm just going to go, because I'm locked into this, I kind of take back what I said. I might, I don't have a lot of time tomorrow, but I might pop on here and try to do a short stream just to do this story mission. Otherwise I can't do anything. And like, I don't have time. I mean, I don't have time to really play on Thursday anyway. Um, so we'll see. There's a chance at around, oh, around 4 p.m. Eastern, I might come on, but I'm only gonna have about two hours. Um, but hopefully I can do this mission in about two hours. Um, so there's a chance tomorrow I'll do a short stream that is just this mission because otherwise I'm locked into this and I can't do anything on this game whatsoever. Uh, I, I, didn't, I didn't know, obviously playing this for the first time, that I was going to do this. If you don't see me tomorrow, you probably won't see me till Friday. But I'm going to try to do that. But I appreciate you all being here. Sorry for a little bit of the internet hiccups um but i hope you